Hello and welcome everyone. Today in this SAP on AWS video, we will discuss how our SAP customers, they can easily manage a huge amount of documents uh, that is uh, their SAP systems are receiving from different other data sources. We'll also discuss that how an easy uh, document management solutions can be built on AWS with by leveraging uh, AWS SDK for SAP above, by leveraging syntax uh, uh, CX link document management solution, and also uh, extend that solution with other machine learning services like Amazon Textract or Amazon Comprehend. My name is Soumya Shekhar Das. I'm a partner solutions architect with Amazon Web Services, specializing on SAP workloads. In the studio, I have Mario with me from Syntax. Mario. Thanks, Soumya. My name is Mario De Felipe. I am a director uh, on SAP on AWS professional services and also CX Link products with at Syntax. Great to have you here, Mario. Thanks for inviting me. So Mario, uh, why SAP on AWS customers, they need a separate document management solution? Can you please uh, give us a use case from uh, large enterprise customers that you are aware of? Yeah. So in S SAP is a large generator of attachments, right? We have uh, invoices, we have materials, we have workflows. All of these uh, business processes in SAP, they generate attachments. So it's a very recommended scenario in SAP that we don't store in the database these attachments for many reasons, right? For example, uh, the, larger the, the larger the database is, longer the, the backup is going to take, um, uh, longer uh, high availability or disaster recovery, right? Yes, so sir. keeping the keeping the size of the of the database uh, uh, under control is uh, is one of these scenarios. Another scenario is. Uh, for customers that want to do document management uh, systems um, uh, around AWS or automated invoice uh, uh, generation uh, on AWS into SAP. That's right. Even it also increases costs for the customers too, right? That when they store all those documents in their uh, SAP databases. Yeah. So on that uh, context, Mario, can we start diagramming here? Can we create an architecture so our customers, they can refer it? Yeah. So let me start. Uh, putting one SAP systems here. So this is our customer's SAP ABAP system where we have the standard modules. They all are uh, as part of this SAP ABAP environment. So let's say that we have the order management, we have finance, Etc. Etc. All the standard modules are installed in as part of SAP above installation. We also have AWS SDK for SAP above that is installed into the SAP environment in the SAP system. Now, from here, it is our customer's system. From here, how we will start integrating? What will be your starting point? Okay. What we provide is an SAP add-on. An add-on uh, is a plugin, but in, a, in an, the SAP world, called CX Link Documents. Documents. That it's installed in the uh, in the SAP ERP environment, and and uh, that can be in the on-premise or can be uh, in the cloud. But what it, gil uh, it will give uh, the customer is the capability to automatically. Uh, use Amazon S3 as um, a storage category, as a content repository okay. in SAP. So once the uh, uh, the add-on is installed and this is a plug and play, the customer will have the capability to store the new attachments by using Amazon S3, but also the capability to migrate the existing document attachments into Amazon S3, so in a, in a short period of time, we will have all that information is store, stored into uh, the Amazon S3, and then is when we can go to the next layer. Right, so the first step would be to store all the existing documents from SAP production databases, SAP systems, from uh, SAP system to Amazon S3 bucket. Then what is the next step? or other repositories, right? right. So th the next step is, imagine you have millions of documents storing very valuable information. Right. Then we leverage 
uh, other Amazon services uh, empowered by machine learning technologies, like for example, Amazon Textract. So imagine, once we have attached all these uh, um, uh, documents, uh, and once we have stored all these attachments, sorry, into Amazon S3, we can uh, call from uh, the AWS SDK for a CPA app, uh, a repo or a program or a, or, a, or a new transaction that we generate, we can directly call Amazon Textract to extract all the valuable information that we have uh, on the Amazon S3. But that information needs to be categorized, right? So that's where we use another uh, Amazon service called Amazon Comprehend. We have seen customers that they use Amazon Comprehend to categorize all the information that they extracted out of, his, uh, out of these attachments because we don't know if blue is a color or is a, or is a vendor or is a, or is a material, yeah. right? All this uh, information needs to be stored somewhere, right? So imagine that we are going to be using DynamoDB to um, um, categorize all the data, all the metadata that we have been extracting uh, of, uh, out of uh, these uh, attachments, uh, these millions of documents that we have in a very short period of, of time into Amazon S3. And again, this is where we can uh, uh, generate uh, programs, reports, transactions, whatever we need in SAP in order, for example, to be using a search engine, right? Okay. So we can search into uh, all the attachments that we have. Um, uh, we can do an easy search in order to tell me all the uh, invoices that I have from this vendor, right? Or, or all the materials that I have from this color, right? Perfect, perfect. Thank you, Mario. Thank you uh, for, for explaining these uh, solutions for our customers and also educating us on CX Link document products. Final question for you. How our customers will get these CX Link documents? CX Link documents is available on the AWS marketplace and ready to be consumed by, by customers. Great to know that. Uh, thank you all uh, for watching this video. Please feel free to reach out to know more uh, how to get started with AWS SDK for SAP ABAP, how to get started with CX Link documents, and how to build a quick POC system and start modernizing your SAP applications. Thank you very much.